Hey everybody, I'm the Linux Gamer. Um, I just watched a video over on EG's channel. If you're not familiar with EG, he is actually a uh, Linux YouTuber just like I am, um, but he does a lot of benchmarks. Him and I have had conversations about how he has trouble with Caden Live being stable or reliable, and he posted a video uh, just tonight about how uh, the problems that he has with Caden Live. If you want to see that video, you should probably watch that before you watch this one. You can click right here to see it. But anyway, uh, I'll give you a brief demonstration of how I use Caden Live to do the videos that I make. Um, first of all, I'll show you kind of what EG does. Um, what he does uh, for his videos is he uses effects to change the scaling and the um, position of video tracks. So you see right here you have 25% and then we'll um, whatever we'll just move this down like this and so he will take you see here we have two different clips you can't see this one yet because I'm not compositing but what I can do is I can copy and paste the effects and then I can tilt this over and I need to actually composite them together. He uses the affine effect and I find that a fine is not fine. <laughs> so if I want to go ahead and try to um, play this video, you'll see that what should be, you know, 25 to uh, 30 frames a second looks like this. Very, very glitchy. And the way that he uh, renders his files um, they actually end up with screen tearing, um, which is weird, but that's what happens. So the way that EG does compositing, um, the more effects you add, the more this is going to uh, suffer performance wise. Don't look at my desk. It's gross. I just cleaned it. I just didn't clean it before this video. Um, <laughs> So the more uh, video tracks you want to add here, the more performance will suffer, right? So now we have three video tracks and I'll move this one right here, okay? And then I'll move this one over more. And see, this just does not stack. Anyway, this is, this is not the way that I would do it, okay? And I'm not trying to criticize EG. I'm just kind of, I just want to share uh, my understanding of Caden Live uh, for optimum performance, okay? Um, so, I'll show you how I would do something set up like this. So, what I would do is I would use compositing. Compositing is another transition effect. Um, and in order for this to work properly, I believe you need an image or a video track underneath. So let's just add um, some gameplay footage. You can you could hypothetically just use a um, a black PNG file or JPEG file. It doesn't matter. Um, but this is the way that I do it, okay? So what I'm what I did is I created a composite layer and then I reduced the size of the video through the composite layer to 50% and then you can just tap um, center horizontally and center vertically or center vertically and then align to the right. You can also composite this video track but what you want to do is go to make this composite onto video track 2 which is where we have the base layer, right? And then do the same thing, 50% um, width, and then uh, vertically align to the center. So now you can see we have a video track here and two other video tracks that are being dynamically scaled by a compositing layer. Don't look at my desk. And I can even bring this over here. In-game footage, there are the two compositing tracks running at what is essentially full speed for both video tracks. And you can actually see here, um, this is my end card, and I use a compositing transition layer 
to achieve this. Um, what I do is I have this PNG with a transparent background um, that has, I'll show you, that's what it looks like, right? And then you can see that's the, that's the gameplay, right? So I have this PNG file, just a static PNG, and then I use compositing to uh, reduce video, uh, each video to 33%, and then I just align it um, to the right. And while um, like scrolling through doesn't work very well, you can see right here, and Steam, links are in the description it's going to transition perfectly fine with no delay no problem what do you think of it leave me a comment and let me know or tweet so yeah i just uh I, and you know i have four well let's see here we have one two three four and five at the maximum we have five video tracks compositing all at once um without stuttering without hiccuping without delay playing the video have you played F1 2015? I mean, 15. What do you think of it? Leave me a comment and let me know, or tweet at me at the Linux Gamer. So, uh, you know, again, I'm not, I'm not saying this to criticize. Uh, I just kind of want to share what I have learned about uh, Caden Live uh, by doing this channel. Um, if you guys have any questions for me at all, uh, let me know because this is the kind of stuff that I live for. I am a huge nerd about video production. So if you have questions, leave them in the comments, tweet at me at the Linux Gamer, let me know because I really want to answer your questions. Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good night.